Isolation of Pure Bacterial Cultures Techniques In this video, you will learn microbiological techniques to isolate pure bacterial cultures by 1. Preparing a streak plate and 2. Preparing a spread plate. Streak Plate Method Several methods exist to separate bacterial cells, but chief among them is the streak plate method. This method is the most economical in terms of time and materials, requiring just a few minutes and only a single plate of media. Its main drawback is that a certain degree of skill is required, which takes time to master. All streak plates are essentially dilutions of bacteria using a solid medium. For this dilution to be effective, it is absolutely essential to realize that bacteria are added only once to the plate from the original culture, which can be either liquid or solid. After streaking the first sector, a sterile loop is used to reduce the number of cells, with no more bacteria being added to the plate. Quadrant Streak First, apply a septic technique streaking an inoculating loop full of microbes from a mixed culture back and forth over area 1 once. Apply lightly to avoid gouging the medium. Then, rotate the plate 90 degrees while keeping the plate closed and streak area 2 several times back and forth with a sterile inoculating loop, hitting the first streak a few times. And again, Rotate the plate another 90 degrees while keeping the plate closed, and streak area 3 several times back and forth with a sterile inoculating loop, hitting the second streak a few times. Next, rotate the plate a final 90 degrees while keeping the plate closed, and streak area 4 several times back and forth with a sterile inoculating loop, hitting the third streak a few times. Results After incubation at 35 to 37 degrees Celsius for 16 to 24 hours with the bottom up, the plates can be observed for isolated colonies. Radiant Streak First, streak the inoculating loop full of microbes in a small area near the edge of the plate in area 1. Apply lightly to avoid gouging into the medium. From the edge of area 1, make 7 or 8 straight streaks to the opposite side of the plate with a sterile inoculating loop. Finally, cross streak over the previous streaks with a sterile inoculating loop starting near area 1. Radiant Streak after incubation at 35 to 37 degrees Celsius for 16 to 24 hours with the bottom up, the plates can be observed for isolated colonies. Spread Plate Method When the concentration of cells in a culture is small, or a highly selective media prevents all but a small number of cells in the culture from growing, less effort is needed to separate them from one another. A spread plate is a method for isolating such a culture. In this method, a small volume of a bacterial culture is used to inoculate the surface of an agar plate, and a sterile glass cell spreader is used to spread the cells over the plate's surface. In this way, a relatively few cells in the culture will be physically separated from one another and will grow into isolated colonies. Its main drawback is that the cells must be in a diluted culture with low concentration. To use the spread plate method, one, place the glass cell spreader in a 95% ethanol beaker. Two, with a sterile transfer pipette, place one drop of sterile water on the center of an agar plate, followed by a sterile inoculating loop full of microbes from a mixed culture and replace the lid. 3. Pass the glass cell spreader through the Bunsen burner with the bent portion of the rod pointing downward to sterilize. Keep the beaker of ethanol away from the flame 
and allow the alcohol to burn off the cell spreader completely. Let it cool for 10 to 15 seconds. 4. Lift the lid of the agar plate at a 45 degree angle and hold it over the base as a shield to prevent airborne contaminants. Lightly touch the sterilized cell spreader to the surface of the agar and move it back and forth while turning the plate manually. This ensures the cells are spread evenly over the entire agar surface. 5. Immerse the cell spreader in the ethanol beaker and re-sterilize it. And 6. Allow the plate to sit upright for 5 minutes and then incubate it in an inverted position, bottom up, at 35 to 37 degrees Celsius for 16 to 24 hours. Results after incubation, the plates can be observed for isolated colonies.